Hello everybody, welcome to season 48 first round match between Daily 56 and his dwarves and Tempest Soul and his undead. We're going to change the topic of conversation right quick, fierce quick, and talk about some Blood Bowl. Hello, Kalon. How are you, Jim? Great to see you, buddy. Thanks for having me on. Uh, what a beautiful uh, dwarf team. It's pretty gorgeous, isn't it? Mmm. Yeah, there's four plus uh, what strengths you got? is incredible. Yeah, four plus strengths all on guard stand firms. Yeah, um, missing the mighty blow, but I mean, boo hoo, right? Yeah, uh, no, that's video. the right call. That's the right call on the strength force. Well, apart from they're an easy blitz, right? So, like, yeah, th there's an argument that you take mighty blow on one of them for the easy blitz, but it's a fucking amazing that they've all got stand firm. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, and fair play to them for keeping on going. Um, and then the, uh, some of them are kind of close to the next level as well. Jeez, it'd be great if they, I mean, some of them might even level, right? Yeah, this they're all about. Seven, and he's a long beard, so yeah, he'd, he'd love to get Mighty Blow. Wouldn't he, though? Yeah. Mm. Or dodge, right? Mm. And you probably take Mighty Blow considering the other three don't have it. Mm. But, uh, yeah, I wouldn't hate dodge. Blodge Firm is oh, pretty sexy. Almost the perfect dwarf, right? Yeah. Yeah. Pretty Except much. he doesn't have mighty blow, but yeah. And uh, here we go. Strength four gonna immediately not be used because <laughs> he wants to hit with mighty blow, <laughs> and yeah. he can get away with the strength three blitz anyway. <laughs> but uh, does get the uh, does get a nice hit on the mummy there. Nothing doing, and yeah. um, so can just kind of stand off with the rest. Uh, so right tackle on both of the mummies is interesting. From time to time. It did it come up in a in last season. We were talking about how break tackle would have been quite useful in a couple of situations. But in general, you're of the opinion that guard is just more useful. Well, yes. I mean, garden stand firm, and after that, you sh up shit creek for mummies. Like, uh, sorry, uh, you, you, grab is the one that you think is more useful. It's than what I've tackle. taken. I don't really like it. I, I'm. I've, it's it's what I pretty much always take, and I'm never really that happy about it. So, I would be willing to give uh, break tackle a go, but I, I wouldn't. Mm. But I'd be willing to. <laughs> <laughs> but I just yeah, wouldn't take sure. it. I just wouldn't take it. But I, it's I just very tricky to justify it on a um, on a move three. Yeah, I wouldn't mind somebody else taking it. Like I don't even mind my piling on. Honestly, on a mummy, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't hate taking piling on instead of grab. That's how unimpactful I believe guard is, uh, grab is. Fair so, yeah, play. Not... You mind if I join? Oh no, not you, Flicky. <laughs> hey, how's it going, <laughs> Flicky? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Oh, dude. Hello. How are you? What a warm welcome. <laughs> I know, right? See, seeing as you've got a cracking pair of tits, you're allowed in. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yep. <laughs> Where did and, that uh, come from? It was incredible. I don't know. Just, just pointing out the, uh, that men and women are not so different. <laughs> no, exactly. Yeah, that's, uh, that's a great point. And very I well made. So. Yeah, I thought it was an excellent point. <laughs> I, I'm kind of I'm, the unfortunate bit is that we've actually we've we've slightly provided some context for it, and I thought that it's going up on YouTube without any context would be slightly funnier. <laughs> so uh, we should probably just leave it at that. Uh, I think so. so. Yeah, welcome yeah. along, Flicky. Great to have you, buddy. What do you think of the teams, man? I think the dwarves have quite a lot of guard. <laughs> That's correct. And guard is good. Yeah, guard is good. Yeah, I think I've heard that somewhere. All right. Yeah. Um, but the uh, the undead are a little bit under cock, maybe. Um, ooh. Undead usually are, aren't they? That's their problem. They've got a wizard. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah and neither mummy with block really. You need both, but mm -hmm. one minimum. Certainly, if you want to go deep in chalice, yeah. Yeah. Um, and the ghouls are the ghouls are okay. Strange, he's carrying on the wrestle, but I suppose with the um, movement, that's why he's got it. But it's yeah. a wrestle dauntless move. Um, well, in fact, does he even have a block ghoul? He doesn't have a block one. No, he's got a guard and two wrestlers. So yeah, wow. three wrestlers. Wow. wow. No, he's got a block tackle one. No, it's a zombie. Okay. That's a zombie. Yeah. Wow. Oof. It is it's a zombie built as well. quite, like quite a nice ghoul. Yeah. yeah. Does, however. Uh, get through the tick skull not using tick skull there properly <laughs> you're welcome jim thanks thanks <laughs> oh look at this chain yeah. oh, oh, oh. do you shoot oh, a play guys yeah can he get another he can get his other guard in here with another push yep and uh and then start a bit of bish baff baffing 
<laughs> yep. As the kids say. <laughs> <laughs> like they don't, they don't do that. Like nobody says that. Oh, I was gonna say, are you sure yeah. that's what the kids say? Yeah, just the cool that's... ones. Yeah, strange one there not to have. Oh, I suppose he's this way he gets more hits on the, on the, uh, on the big lads. But uh, I thought he was gonna go for another chain there to shove his, uh, shove one of the other guys in, because now he's got a blitzer in there. Whereas it would have been nicer if he'd had. Uh, two long beards for the tackle because they would have been in base with, with all of the ghouls. Yeah. But uh, I suppose it's fine, really. Yeah, it's fine. He's got tackle on the ball, hasn't he? And then. It does. He's got, he's got a mummy down. Yeah. Instantly, yeah. He's, move back, he's very narrow, though. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Then saw, maybe... saw the undead, so. They are. This might have been their <sighs> one chance to sort of spread out of it. Yeah. The run back there seems a bit panicked early. Mm. Um, I'm not sure about it, especially with the blizzard. I know it's on plus move, but I mean, I don't think he needed to go back that far. Oh, and wow, he went for the GFI blitz. Wow. Yeah, not a fan of that. Yeah, not a fan of that. Um, yeah, especially when you're giving away this many hits. Yeah. Yeah. Just a stun. Vibes. It's a big stun at this stage. Mm -hmm. And he obviously hits him so he can blitz the ghoul. Mm. Hit him in the ghoulies. Right in the gowl. Yeah. <laughs> Classic. Ooh. The one Classic. time it's oh, not a one in nine getting... when you blitz wrestle, it's double bloody skull. Yep, yeah, of course it is, yeah. Had to put the reroll in. And because he didn't get a pow on the second hit, obviously it survives fully. Uh, of course, if he'd, if he'd managed the double pow there on, on reroll, it would have obviously been an injury. That is an injury that sticks, though, and that's the strength four. Mighty blowout. That's pretty much most of his teeth. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's a big one. Curious if he decides to plug anything else in against this mummy, and uh, he decides it's not worth the while, and he's better off spreading out, which is kind of fine, I suppose. Yeah. He's yeah. Really nice stand firm positioning here. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think that's fine right now. That he's rectified that. Uh, Problematic situation. I think mean, not hitting there is better, right? Because the dub skull's terrible. Agreed. And, like even the follow isn't great there. No, it isn't. No. Ooh. Well, well it would appear Tempa Soul is um, very worried about the situation. Mm. Uh, backing off again. I know it's got a lot of turn, but I mean the dwarfs are just going to completely dominate all of this now, and I think that's going to be very tricky to get out of. It is. Yeah, just taking a couple of hits here, but I mean, they're just going to stay there and, you know, one of those things when you're playing against dwarves, especially dwarves like this, you're you're, you're delighted because you've had a really good turn and you knock three of them down and then they just stand up. <laughs> yep. Well. Hello, Dimmy. And uh, that is a hot take, Galentio. Snow definitely does not benefit dwarves. <laughs> no, I wouldn't have thought so. Because uh, the dwarves aren't trying to uh, score. Yep. Yep, pick yeah. the pow. Pick the pow. Mm, well done. I don't, because of the undead just can't move them around, though. They, they don't have to move. They don't have to GFI anywhere. They can just stay where they are. Mm -hmm. I think he had to stretch them two turns ago. Make it some sort of move. I concur, yep. You did indeed call it flicky as well. You said that they were too narrow. And uh, and, it, and it's coming. It's coming. Um, it's coming to four now. It's coming home. Yeah. A la maison. <laughs> yeah, so just a lot of standing. And, uh, yeah. Let's get a nice big hit on this boy. Oh, Mighty Blow does nodding to him. And, uh, yeah, he's going to have to, realizing the situation, he's going to have to start coming forward. But um, he's not going to have much protection if he does get to the, to the central line. He's going to have to start potatoing. Yeah. No white. See, I saw him lose the strength four. Is the other white already gone? Yeah, um, I think there was only one. Yeah, there was only one, I believe. Yeah. yeah and only three ghouls. It, it was just a bit of a fucking shit undead team, to be honest. <laughs> Had a nice record. Got himself the chalice. Fair play to him. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's a horrible draw for him, to be fair. It is, yeah. 
I mean, dwarves are never a nice draw at the best of times, but certainly not ones with fucking 10 guard and 4 strength 4. Oh, yeah. It's, uh, it's basically an orc team, isn't it? Mm. Um, Dio did not win Norton Sandwich. He was uh, he was Amazons versus dwarves. <laughs> Uh, but no, you know, like it's not that simple. But no, he, he did not. Ooh, daily putting the reroll in here on this uh, dodge out. What was it dodge blitz? Was it? Yeah, it was the blitz. Still had a three plus to get the blitz afterwards. So. Oh my god! Oh really? Wow. Okay. Temper Soul he... is a bit of a lunatic, honestly. Like I've just realised his Temper Soul, and yeah, yep. he likes fouling with elves normally. So yeah, I'm not surprised. Because he's <laughs> he's being pretty a bit fond of. Oh here. no, and he went for the GFI as well. And I mean, so I best mean, case scenario, yeah. you're gonna be one one at the end of the game now. And that's a turnover, and now you just get blitz straight away. Yeah. Not what I would have done. Uh, no, it's got a bad. Indeed. <laughs> Maybe if more people rolled more dice, I'd like it more. Mhm. Mm Doesn't bring his ball carrier back uh, to try to pick up the ball. I suppose he's got a blitzer free. It's scoring a very tough. Threat, push. It's scoring threat. He wants to go. Oh, it's only turn and... seven. Yeah, of course. Yeah. He wants to make it a. Uh... It's still a bit tricky to get this down though, because the guy blitzing doesn't have tackle and yeah, has to dodge off. So no tackle on this hit, but the, I suppose the boat down is fine. Yeah, plus the re-roll in. And plus he can just pin him, well okay, he doesn't pin him against the sideline. He could have pinned him against the sideline. Oh, okay, does it that way. Yeah, there you go. Fine. Yeah, that is, that's so actually that's, much better. That's pretty nice. Would, yeah, it is. Was the push not enough? Was he not out of range with the push? Well, yeah, I would, have, I would have taken the push personally, but you know. With the initial, the the, yeah, turn. save the reroll, yeah, I, I, I can Because you can't score, so you just you just yeah. save your reroll for next turn, so that next turn maybe you can get the score with, with a reroll. Yeah. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think that was a mistake by Daily56. Yeah. One of the oldest Blood Bowl players around, obviously, there. God obviously, yeah. He is. 66, yeah. is he? Must, must be. Mm. Yeah. My man's terrible, though. The only thing that makes though. any sense. Yeah. Well, does get guard in. Needs a big pow on this, but uh, needs another assist. It's a 1D. Oh, that gets, gets the full it. pow. But uh, can he get it somewhere safe? Huge stun. Huge stun. Huge. And uh, dare not do the GFIs. And might as well just hang on to the ball because the recovery is very poor here. Kind of non existent, in fact. Yeah. And uh, probably not even worth trying to go for a blitz on him. Yep, so it's realizing that, decides blitz. to do a 1D blitz. <laughs> Why not well, stand up the guard? I yeah. don't want to. Yeah. Oh, now he stands That up. was uh, surprising. Yeah. Does get Just to put this guy down. For yeah. moves, Deccan. Chalice, chalice nerves, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Which is fair, I suppose. Yeah. It's tricky, you know? Terrified of Artemis calling him a penguin. Mm. But that's, I mean, that's a more likely thing to actually be worrying him than the uh, the chalice nerves. Is uh, <laughs> what, what Artemis says afterwards. <laughs> um, did I just see that ghoul get the guard ghoul get two diced by a not strength up guy? No, Is that guard ghoul? Did, did he? Yeah. Oh, it was just a 1D. Okay, fair enough. Sorry. <clears throat> For a second, I thought the guard ghoul was only string two. Oh, you thought it was a diog. You thought it was a diog. Yeah. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> I mean, you might you might keep a guard ghoul if it had edge two, maybe. Yeah, I'd keep an edge one with. I'd, I'd keep an edge one anything with guard, to be honest. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. I don't know. It's a it's a it's a tricky one. Uh, it depends on the position, right? Like, because um, if you're limited in positionals on certain teams, but I'm 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 purely thinking out of outliers rather than. I, I I agree with your sentiment. I wouldn't keep an edge one war dancer, but then you can't have an edge one war dancer. You so can't have okay. an edge one war dancer. Yeah. So I don't think there's any player with edge one with guard that I wouldn't keep one of. Like if all of four of your blitzers were edge one, then I probably wouldn't yep. keep, them. and they all only had guard. Mm-hmm. But. Um, 
for Chalice, <laughs> you know, for no, Chalice, no yeah, rookie, yeah, no rookie. Like, I'd rather have an Edge One Human Guard Blitzer than an Edge Three Not Guard. Yes. Yeah, no, that's fair. Yeah. Well, Riot's an interesting one. Mm. Uh, I suppose it probably does favour uh, the dwarves, doesn't it? Because they're just going to took. The, it's just going to be a slow, methodical move down the pitch. Oh, no, Ryan, Ryan makes it hard for them though, because they can't GFI, right? So. Yeah, but they were they were going to score on turn sixteen anyway. Now they just. Well, now they might not. One, okay. two, three, four, five, six. It's about six turns to score for them going max every turn. <laughs> going max, yeah, yeah. <laughs> And you know, some ghouls in the backfield. For sure. Surprising enough then that he decided to um, not bring. Um, that he decided not to. or to bring one of the beards back as well. I suppose it makes sense for the. to be a little bit more cautious about the pickup, but I mean, they're way out of range of this. So. Oh, it's a blitzer as well, so it's not even good cover. You've got, you got a bit of movement though back there, so he can get back relevant if it goes well. Okay. Mm -hmm. I would. I would have not kept these guys back. I would have definitely. I would definitely yeah, moved have these to, forward and across, yeah, and they, then moved this guy over. They have to take the space. Yeah. Yeah, and then they're just gonna jam a couple of mummies right in that uh, mm -hmm. big gap there. You'd think so, but yeah, you'd think so, but he hasn't not, rammed. Not going to go first. Just, no. He's just tickled instead of ramming. <laughs> <laughs> yep. I mean, let's <clears throat> yeah, that's uh, that's rough. I would have I would have ran personally. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Ramming speed. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> <laughs> Ramming uh, speed was uh, one of my dancer names. Ah, uh, was it? Hmm. <laughs> what kind of dancer were you? Uh, interpretive. <laughs> oh, private. <laughs> <laughs> the best kind of dancer. The best kind, yeah. yeah. I'm actually, I'd show you now, but it, it doesn't work over voice. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to need some videos on Discord, though. <laughs> I'll be happy to sort them out. <laughs> Well, we all have our little talents, you know. Hellbutt is the songs. I do a bit of interpretive dance. <laughs> you I mean, you combine just... the two, and I yeah. think we're on to a winner. We are. <laughs> what on earth do you do if you're the unpaired? You just, just think. At least I can qualify next season with something better. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I suppose he can make some trades here, which would work out in his favour. He can kind of keep some of these uh, these really good uh, dwarfs held down. The stun on the mummy in the centre is pretty terrible, but at least he can get his other mummy into a position to support him for when he does get back up. I mean, what he wants to do is he wants to trade teams with his opponent. That would be the good yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that blitz. He could have made it just to, just to get in base at the top and stood atop the downed mummy. Um which I think would have been a better square and maybe gone for the wrestle blitz on one of the guys at the top because he's just he's he's giving himself multiple fights to lose rather than trying to pick one that he can win. Hmm. Yeah, that sounds good, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, from a commentating point of view. Yeah. Or, yeah, yeah, okay. That cool. yeah. Like I, a, I was going like, why would that be a good thing? <laughs> that sounded like a good a good bit of commentary, that's all. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah, yeah, it was like it was like what a professional might say. I, wow. Yeah. yeah. Thanks. Like my death all of a sudden. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just I'm, I'm really enjoying how surprised you are that I said something insightful. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Well, it wasn't a tale about interpretive dance or the swarm <laughs> yeah. lord. Or... <laughs> you should see my interpretive dance of the swarm lord. Actually, it's, um, <laughs> it's 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 multilingual as well because of course it is Senor de la Horde, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's. It's title. Well, it's title is actually a smell. <laughs> <laughs> Just because I was trying to work cross cross media. So. Uh... See, this is more Kalon standard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> this is more the type of shit I normally say. <laughs> he, had his, he had his little moment. Yeah. <laughs> and now he's back. Uh, don't mind me. Just amusing myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's really afraid to take these uh, dice as well. Would have been. Ah, oh, so plus was it's in the blizzard, so it's not like that mummy was going to do the GFI anyway. So yeah, probably exactly. better off yeah, not, not bothering to take the the one D for the the two D first. Yeah, it's pretty. Although fuck, fuck it, he's in a bit of trouble though. So I kind of wouldn't have hated to have seen it be the last action just to get him in position. Even yeah, if he fills his dodge the there. One. I quite like that. I quite like blitzing with the other one instead. But yeah, that's, okay. that's okay, isn't it? Because it but kind it, of does the same thing, almost. Mm. Like, do you know what I mean? Because if he'd blitzed, he'd have just been there, wouldn't he? So. But he could have done both, right? Yeah. What? what? He could have done both. He could have done the blitz with that guy, got that guy into position, and then when the other guy was on the ground, he could have done the GFI into the square that that dwarf just fell into. Yeah. And, like, you know, if it fails, it fails, but at least the mummy's in a much better position. Do you think it's much better? I don't think it's much better. Mm. I think it's just okay. marginally better, so I think it's fair enough. That's I, fair. I, I like going for the safer. Like, but he's probably still going to lose anyway. But... Well, that's the thing. He's in He's in too too much trouble. I think taking a few risks isn't oh. terrible. That was clearly oh. a, missed, a misclick. Oh. Yeah. Oh. He didn't realise. Does the guy on the ground there must have... Because that was a six plus dodge. But do you know what it wasn't? It Go wasn't on. a blockless dodge. <laughs> <laughs> and, All of a uh, sudden, yeah. I'm going to oh, score. Did actually use uh Well, it wasn't. It wasn't an armor break, so it didn't get to use tick skull correctly either. Oh, tragedy. Tragedy. And the feelings come. <laughs> Gotta love a bit of steps. Yeah. The famous step song, tragedy. Hmm. Yep. Only Nobody else sung it. that. Yep. Nobody. Nobody else. Definitely a step song. Mm. That's pretty nice to get that stand firm shoved in there. It is, yeah. Yeah. It'd be nice to. He's got some guard who can make it down around the back here. Pretty yeah. good. Just needs to shove a guy in at the top of yeah. this, and then he's got this guy to come. Oh. Well, that guy could have gone to that square, right? Yeah, I would have rather had him further up, but, you know, yeah. it's still good penetration. It is. As far as penetration goes. It isn't bad at all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Considering how bad his last turn was. Yeah. I bet you'll be shocked to be in this spot after last turn. Like that fucking dodge. Holy shit. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, I don't think that mummy got round far enough in front. Mm -hmm. He's got Dauntless on this boy. He does get the full power on this. I mean, it's not really huge, but it does mean he's... Uh, well, I suppose he just gets up and surfs straight away, right? But it does take mm -hmm. up your blitz action. Ooh. Ooh, and the 1 in 81 oh puts that wow. guy down. Yeah. And that blitzer's been stuck over there on the left for the majority of, the, for, of this half, right? Yeah. This is yeah, going to be... Yeah, dodged off at some point, I guess. Yeah. Oh. Oh, this is nice. He can block and then he can... can block and then, well, provided yeah, he stays in. Yeah, provided he stays in. Don't get removed. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah, but even if he doesn't, you can just you can just do other things, can't you? So it's alright. Like blitzing this ghoul anyway. Yeah, blitz that ghoul anyway, yeah. Nice. No armor um, break. Yep, yeah, no armor break. The ball. You certainly yeah. can. It's a wrestle really ghoul easily. as well. Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah. So it does get the surf. But, uh, get, yeah. Get the dodge, get to the ghoul. No, a bit far away, isn't it? Well, it's a 3 plus, 5 plus, right? To get the ball down. Yeah. Because he does have wrestle. Doesn't, I mean, it's his large, large character. Yeah, I think you dodge out that blitz of the dodge yeah. out, cover the ghoul, 3 plus, yeah, 3 plus. Got to. 3 plus, 3 plus, you just have to, yeah. 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 Got to give it something. You've got to give it a four plus, not a three plus, at least. Yeah, it's exactly, easy. yeah. And if you put a guy, yeah, it's an answer four plus two. But then I guess he's mm -hmm. got four three instead of three three, so it's not that good. But yeah. you still got to try. Mm -hmm. no. Oh, he fails the GFI. Gets the pow. Oh, 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 oh. Full pow. Instant wow. full pow. Oh, 
can't go for the pickup because it's could. another big he put up, but maybe you have to go. For maybe the you have to. yeah, maybe. Have because to. he's trying to just tie all of these guys up with this uh, skelly instead, and just hope that they roll some one in nines. Mm. Oh, okay. Well, at least he's uh, at least he's okay for overtime, because it does look likely. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. It's just too easy to clear and get the two defense, yeah. and that's the, that's the problem. Mm. So we probably had to go for the. It's two up. GFIs in the snow. Yeah. Yeah, but the and clear the, though, like the the school. Oh my oh, god! Oh, okay, well there you go. Wow, the schools the clear, wow. but still, yeah. the the clear is so easy, and then the yeah, power is so yeah. easy that like, well not the power, sorry, the the push, right? If he picked it up, yeah. he keeps the ball here. He keeps the ball yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. Fair play. So two threes. After the pickup. Oh, well. <laughs> walks in. There we go. Good lord. Yeah, like that's kind of overly critical because it's like it's understandable. Like most of us would probably not go for that GFI to pick it up. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Most of us would probably just not do it. But it's one of those situations where it's better have because to, yeah. yeah, you just have to. Yes. Yeah. Just the odds are. Yeah, you just have to put it in your own hands, don't you? I mean, fair play to uh, Tempest Soul for managing to make a game of this. Uh, like, on paper, you would not have expected it to have gone this far. And uh, yeah, the one turns on as well. He does have the move eight. Uh, should probably set up for... Or move, yeah, move eight. He should probably set up for this, at least. Too much stand here. Uh, oh, he's he got stand up. firm. Yeah, okay. he has set up for it. He's got five so, stand firm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why he's set up... Um, like the other two I guess once you're exposing two strength fours you might expose two more but it seems weird like to just set up oh, yeah. just you set could just up set up in it. or set up in riot defense right because the riot is now his main way of winning yeah, yeah just set up three on the OS. it doesn't make any sense to give them the other two no mm. that makes no sense uh, hello Sata the, the, you missed another game um, Dio versus dwarves and it's another dwarf game randomly uh, which is daily 56 versus Thomas Soul. <laughs> How is that the field? I'm trying to stay calm. I'm trying not to be too excitable. <laughs> you know what I'm like? He, he was a little bit excitable in chat when he told us about his, his <laughs> lovely pair of tits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, may, may, I mean, I imagine his tits are beautiful. Yeah. Nobody's, nobody's taking that from him. <laughs> I'll take him at his word. <laughs> I yep. don't. I don't require video evidence. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, does get a power. You on don't this want guy. to see them perform an interpretive dance. <laughs> oh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> tassels or no tassels is the main big yeah. question there. Like, Just think know. of cheerleaders, but less green. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least they're less green. Beautiful. Phew. Yeah. Phew. <laughs> Well, there you go. Um, well, that was a match, wasn't it? Congratulations, Daily 56, Commiserations, Tempest Soul, I think. It was indeed. Uh, thank you, Flicky and Kalon, glorious. Yeah, pleasure. Welcome. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>